Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Namri. Welcome back to If My Heart Had Wings. Last time, uh, <laughs> a lot of events actually happened last time. I'm trying to recap everything that happened last time I recorded. First, we got Aoi finally making a move with Kotari. Finally, thank freaking god. And then she had to leave for a little bit for Oban for the family, which was good. That a cute little dis disgustingly adorable conversation uh, <laughs> over the phone. And now we're back, and I think she's back now. Anyway, let's go ahead and replay this real quick. Uh, how do I do this? There you go. As soon as they met at the secret base, they took on beaming expressions. If Kotari hadn't been in the wheelchair, perhaps they would have been hugging. And finally, Amane and Kotori are there together, finally! Amane, who's been facing the computer and typing away, lifted her head after a delay. <laughs> oh yeah, also, Amane got licensed to drive a scooter around. Or I guess a bike. I think it's a scooter, I'm not sure. Uh, but yeah, Amane riding a vehicle. It's gonna be scary. <laughs> That's what everyone's worried about, the fact that you have a license. After meeting Amane after a while, Kotori suddenly began to lecture her. That input inside of her is cute too. It is. Kotori lined up panda cookies and panda jam buns. あ、かわいい。食べるのもったいなくなっちゃうね。ママネちゃん。はい、これ。何だこれは。交通安全の <laughs> oh my god, that is... Oh my god, I mean, it's good that Amani got, you know, a charm and it's very nice of Kotri to, uh, go to a shrine and, all, and do all that to make sure that Amani, you know, is safe and sound. But that's quite a slap in the face, like, if my friend did that, I'd be like, do you not really believe that I could drive? <laughs> <laughs> It's still really sweet of her, though. <laughs> no one cut in and asked why emotion would uh, in enhance the charm. I don't know. Uh, who cares? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Kotori spreads out the pictures again. <laughs> oh, yeah, she did go to the zoo with the family, didn't she? She did tell Aoi that she did. Kotori speaks passionately while also showing pictures of tigers, lions, and crocodiles. It seems that the zoo was extremely fun. After listening to Kotori talk about her trip for a while, Oh, let's see what we got here. Looking at the thing, I get one to show her. Kotori bent her head to the side. Since there is no seat, it's hard to see what it is from just a glance. <laughs> Kotori got closer and looked hard at it. これが操縦かんでこっちのレバーでラダー操作だ。両方とも手で操作できる。もう一息で完成するから。そしたら飛べるよ。あんたも。うん。うん。ありがとう。みんな。Oh, it's a nice picture right here. I kind of like it. I like just all three of them together. Although I realize that Aoi haven't even said a single thing so far. Is he even present in this scene right here? What if he's not? What if he's like away somewhere? We're just seeing the interaction between these three. Or I guess us as well, the four. We'll see what happens. 
Everyone smiled as if to say, You're welcome. Everyone was full of energy and set about working. Aoi has not said a single thing I just noticed there. <laughs> not a single thing, but whatever. <laughs> Maybe you're silent. Maybe you just kind of, you know, just letting everybody get together. Kotri muttered this while watching Amane start the engine on the scooter. Amane, please be careful going home. There he is, finally! Amane got on her scooter while saying this and added, The scooter carrying Amane chugged along slowly, found the speed limit and drove away. Oh, look at that. that. Actually, I like this. I don't know why, but <laughs> seeing something moving, seeing something new added, I like that. God, this is so well done. I gotta say, this version of it is so well put together. Ignoring the translation and some mistakes, it looks so good. Please, somebody, in the com go to the comment section, like, message me on Twitter or something. I mean, you guys already posted a lot of recommendations for games to play, and I got them on the list and gonna be looking out for sales on them. But please, if you have anything that is of this quality in the writing and visuals and audio as well, please let me know. I would love to experience it. A convenience store came into view. This is where Agha uh, splits off to go home. Agha came over to where I was. <laughs> ちゃんと小鳥に甘えさせてあげなさいよ。うん。あの子ずっと青いの方を見て、そわそわしてたわよ。おお。それじゃ、また明日ね。バイバイ、アゲハ。おやすみなさい、アゲハ先輩。また明
lights weren't on in the room, and perhaps because of the dimness, the silence was almost palpable. Yeah? Of course not. <laughs> what did she think that I was actually gonna cheat on her? Come on, we know Aoi better than anybody. Honestly, he's like the best protag so far of any, I guess, visual novel, any media that we've experienced together. At least I can confirm. Aoi, best male protag out there. <laughs> he wouldn't cheat. Kotaro rubbed her cheek against my hand as if out of relief. Somehow, it feels good. What is it? Oh, okay, I will. She didn't even have to ask. I continued to stroke her hair. Her glossy hair was still a bit damp from her bath, and it felt different than usual. I stroked it softly. <laughs> With a content look on her face, Kotri trembled slightly. Do you like having your hair stroked? She answers while shivering absor absorbedly. She was like a cat who had gotten catnipped. That's because you have a small head, Kotori. Kotori's head is round and nicely shaped. Natural beauties are made of different stuff than the rest of us. Completely absorbed, Kotori squeezed my hand and brought it toward her chest. The next thing I knew, Kotori was looking up at me with moist eyes. As Kotori is in a, as Kotori is in a wheelchair, she almost always looks up at me. So it's not as though she is doing her purpose, but it's good to the point of being sneaky. Then... Aww! <laughs> Kotori puckered her lips and pointed them forward. On it upward. I'm sorry, but they're so disgustingly cute. Aren't they? God! <laughs> <laughs> Makes me melt just a little bit. <laughs> Look, I like this kind of sappy, sappy shit, alright? I, I absolutely love it. Especially if I see like an anime or visual novel format. I think it's the most, like, a, just adorable thing ever. <laughs> uh, and they're kind of cute together. You spoil girl. I gave her a peck on her lips. <laughs> I guess there's no choice. We kissed, lightly pressing our lips together. What was that? Sorry to have done that to you. There's no way that would happen. I'd kiss my pillow too. <laughs> well then, are we? Good, good. That's good, buddy. Yeah, really. But the actual thing is much better. <laughs> Kotori is being shy. I kissed her again. Kotori is always cute, but today she looked even cuter than usual. But yeah, you guys haven't seen each other in a long time, of course. Maybe it's because I haven't been able to see her for- I can connect easy with this Aoi protag. Easy, no problem, seriously. I get this guy. I completely get this guy. He's my type of protag. <laughs> Still holding hands with Kotori, I sit down on her bed. Then I looked around her room vaguely. This is the third or fourth time I've entered Kotori's room. No matter how close we are, we can't very well just enter a girl's room. Aren't you going to turn on the lights? <laughs> so that's why she was peering at me through the crack in our door like that. That's not true. It's simple. That There was basically nothing on placed on the floor, probably because it wouldn't get in the way when she moved her wheelchair. Kotori doesn't have any typical hobbies, it seems. I heard that she liked to move her body, so before the accident, she probably exercised a lot. Kotori held out both of her hands. Alright, I want to lift up Kotori, but then wait here for a moment. How do you usually get into your bed? She demonstrated the action of what she spoke. 
葵君には見せたくない Why? なんとなくきっと変だって思うだろうから I'd seen her get in and out of a wheelchair and it looks like he just looks like just doing that was rather difficult I'm sure it's a lot of effort to get into the bed I took Kotori's hand and held her close <laughs> I lift her I lift, God what's wrong with me I lifted her like that and then sat ne sat her next sat her down to the bed Jesus what's so sorry <laughs> literally swept her off her feet <laughs> good job Aoi. <laughs> good job Aoi. Kotori was at her wit's end perhaps she hadn't emotionally prepared for it to be honest I felt a little awkward too but Kotori is more bashful than she had to be so I was fine also this is also really cute <laughs> When she blushes like that, it's actually kind of cute. Then I sat her down on the bed. Or so I thought. <laughs> Kotori tumbled backwards and fell over. Are you okay? <laughs> Kotori spoke shyly, facing away from me. It wasn't just awkwardness. It seems she really was embarrassed. I realized that for Kotri, who doesn't have to use her lower body, it's easy to fall forward or backwards when she doesn't have a seat back uh, and isn't careful. I my hand out to help her, but she refused to take my hand. Maybe she's embarrassed that I saw her like this. You can just stay like that. <laughs> I lifted Kotri's legs onto the bed. I got onto the bed myself and lay next to her. Wow, I will move it in fast. Damn. <gasps> well, I got my next CG right here. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Went from just going to a girl's room to say hang out with her, now lay next to her in the bed. Alright, are we? Alright. Perfect. CG of all CGs done right here. I I might not even want to cover it up with other stuff. Maybe I will, but I seen some Google pictures of this, but I, I wanted to not think about it. And now seeing this, I'm so happy. Oh my god! Finally! Oh, I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so happy, but maybe it's because I'm kind of just happy seeing the progress, seeing their relationship progress in such a way. I don't know. It just makes me feel happy just seeing all this happen, you know. And finally getting to a point where they're gonna just get probably just cutesy and lovey-dovey. I'm probably gonna go. I don't know. Whatever couples do, <laughs> in the beds together. <laughs> anyway, it's easier, isn't it? Mm. <laughs> I thought it'd be easier to be close. Kotori says this with her eyes tearing up. I rub my face and lips to hers and then kiss the tip of her nose. Can I hug you? I hug Kotori gently, enveloping her small body. Alright, she definitely likes it. Wrapped in her arms, Kotori let out a strange sigh. Your hair smells so good, like shampoo. Pressed my nose to her hair and took in the scent. No way, I just took a bath. Don't talk about people like they're some kind of a delicacy. <laughs> oh, you don't ruin this moment. Do not ruin this moment. I unwrapped my arms from her and looked at her from the front. Kotori, I love you. Kotori looked back at me. <laughs> okay, then go to bed and go to sleep with us. Okay then. <laughs> Alright. She closed her eyes. Hey, don't go to sleep. Exactly. Kotri, aren't you being a little defenseless? Huh? I might play tricks on you while you're sleeping. <laughs> she says that seriously. Could be. Somehow it seems like she wants me to tease her like that. Okay, I'll put your nose until we wake up. You okay? 
下手したら私が死んじゃうじゃない<laughs> Now just realizing that You're slow to realize I'm not going to cover I'm not going to cover your mouth でももしそんないたずらされたとしても許す葵くんだから I'm not going to do anything to you うん知ってる葵くん優しいもん Totally changes her expression and smiles at me. I'm not convinced as she,、uh, as she called me nice right after saying I was mean. But I guess all that matters is that she trusting me. Trust me. Huh? Okay. As I reply, I reach my hand out and stroke Kotri's head gently. <laughs> What is that reaction? It's so cute. <laughs> it really makes you happy, doesn't it? Wanna stroke your hair? She answers affirmatively with so much power. I feel so happy too. To be with you. Oh my god! I'll be the smooth talker, man. For a moment ago, all of her reactions have been funny and so cute. You don't have to be so earnest. I'm really happy, but. Kotri whispered this in a lonely way, inching closer to me a bit. Well, now we're together. She must have been really lonely. But it's strange. We're all apart for a little bit. But I miss you so much. <laughs> Kotri nods several times while she says this. Not gonna lie, I can sort of actually, actually very much relate to that. <laughs> Why is this visual n o v e l so relatable? Why is it so easy to relate to it? I mean, it's great that it is, but. Why is this so relatable? I can legit relate to how they feel. I've actually experienced this before. <laughs> I'm not gonna pour out my love left, but I will confirm that I have experienced a similar feeling before. <laughs> God, why? This is too relatable, man. Too real. <laughs> <laughs> Too real! Oh god, it's getting better and better. By, the,、uh, by those calculations, it, I've been old man after only a few weeks. Like Rip Van Winkle or something. <laughs> no, I didn't say that. You beautiful, you beautiful princess. Are you pleased, my princess? <laughs> God, that's so disgusting, a d o r a b l y cute. Oh my god, it kills me on the inside. I caught a glimpse of that pleased princess smile in the moonlight. I'm glad I'm not Rip Van Winkle. Oh god,、uh, I was expecting something else there. I don't need anything dangerous like that. It's not like Kotori had such a box anyway. Let's see. I don't actually have much think to do. Yeah, I already have what I want. Oh, dude! Wow. <laughs> smooth talker Aoi. Holy crap, he's smooth. I softly stroke Kotri's hair. I'm happy that I finally got what I wanted to. Of course I am. <laughs> My time with Kotri and the mood of the moment, along with everything else, is a treasure to me. Channeling that feeling, I softly stroke Kotri's head. <sighs> I will. Her smooth hair, which gives no resistance at all, passed right through my fingers. Texture felt so nice to the touch, I couldn't take my hand away. What is going on here, by the way? The touching hands? No. Why, why are we framing at 
Kotori's chest. <laughs> uh, is this gonna move forward? <laughs> well, I continue to slowly move my hands through her hair. Kotori closed her eyes peacefully. Although she always changes her expressions while awake, now she looks so calm. Hmm? When she's awake, it means that now she is... Kotori? She asleep? My princess? God damn, owie, it's smooth, fucking smooth, holy shit! Oh, I can't believe this girl. <laughs> My sudden urge to laugh must have come out, come out because I was overcome with how happy I felt. It's the unmistakable truth that right now, I'm, I'm that in love with Kotari. I guess I didn't have to sing a lullaby. Anyway, I granted my princess wish of sleeping next to her, so it's fine. Her sleeping face looks so content, so I'm sure she's satisfied. Foie? I'm not sure how to really do a foie, but I'm, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna ignore this foie. I don't know how to do a foie, guys, sorry. Most importantly, I'm able to sleep next to Kotri. Nothing could make me as happy as this. Good night, Kotri. I lightly kiss her forehead and fix her comforter. I close my eyes while talking, in this, while taking in the sweet scent that floated about her hair. Well, moved on to Kotri's bedroom. That's a step forward. <laughs> that was really freaking adorable. Not a, not gonna lie, that was so freaking adorable. Ah, this is great. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Sam Rio. Welcome to Blah, Blah, Blah. Hello, what have we got here? Hello, ladies. How's it going? Breasts are the treasure of the I kind of want to say you could dress better. 